Okay, this is you Dan and I'm going to show you how to change the font on the menu bar using the skin Noxilvo. Let's just see. Yeah, earlier Noxilvo. Yeah. It doesn't matter if you've already started creating your build. Yeah, you can still do this. Won't matter. Yeah. But this is just a fresh install. Yeah. So what you want to do now exit out of that you need to go in your web browser I go here for me fonts a thousand and one free fonts dot com uh, you can pick any font you want yeah let's see um, metal lord click that click to download do, 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 no. Yeah, that will do me. Save. Saying it's done, so let's open the. Let's go to the folder. I'm in the folder, so what you need to do now is unzip it. No. Once it's unzipped, go into it. There's the font file. Yeah. It's a dot t t f, yeah. Copy it. And what you need to do now is go into your app data. You call the app data. Right, there's my Cody folder. Click on add-ons. Click on the skin area, knock silvo. Go up to sixteen times nine. In others that could be 720 or 1080p, yeah. In this one, it's 16 times 9. Go into there, scroll down until you find the font XML. Uh, sorry, I've gone jump too far. See where it says fonts? Click on fonts, yeah. Paste in that font. There it is, Metal Lord font, yeah. Now you're back into the skin, click on 16 times 9. Yeah, scroll down until you find the font dot XML. You need to open it in Notepad plus plus or similar. Yeah, then you get this. Yeah, loads of fonts. Well, nearly every aspect of text in Kodi can be changed. No on every page. Yeah, so. What line do we need for the menu bar? Right, scroll down until you come to it's somewhere around here. Let's scroll down. There it is. It's on line five three eight. See where it says font main menu. Yep. There's the font. There, sorry, the font it's using at the moment yeah but we don't want that font we want to use uh, we want to use the metal load font yeah so what I do here is I just copy that copy I'm only copying the text name or the name I'm not copying the file I'm just copying that name as it is there yeah so Go back into it. Yeah. Where is it? Font main menu. And all I do is highlight that, delete, paste in a new name. Yeah. So it's like that. Yeah. That's it. That's all you need to do. Click save. Close the font XML. Then close Notepad plus plus. Or what you can do now is just open Kodi. Yeah, and there it is. Yeah, if it looks a bit too big, go into open. Uh, hang on, I'll just go back into the app data and open it that way. Font, oh, wrong one. 16 times 9. Go 
to the front, open it again in Notepad++, plus plus. scroll down to 5, I think it was 28 or 38, I scroll down, is it 28 or 38, yeah, there it is there, and there's your font size, so because that was too big, let's try 80, yeah, save, I'll have to exit and come out, yeah, exit, yeah, just start Cody back up again, see it's made it a little bit smaller, yeah, and that's all you need to do, yeah, to change others, other fonts, you that see there's the vertical menu and that's the one you'd need to change if you were using the vertical menu, yeah. But all these are different fonts for different parts of Cody. Look, see that there where it says the date, that'll be a font. You'd have to you'd have to look and tweak each one until you find the didn't uh, the font for that, yeah. It's a, I know it's a pain in the ass, but once you get used to it, you'll know what you're doing. Yeah, but that's how you do it. Yeah, pretty easy. This is Zudan. Till next time. Ta-da.